Good evening, gamblers. It's me again, the Texas Gambler. I'm back, and I've got Lucky Dog Cool Cats. Tickets number 109 through 125. Got the end of the book. 17 tickets. So I finished it off. See what we can win today. No new news on the Texans front. I did see a recycled article about a million dollar winner where they scratched off the VIP winnings or something like that. I think is the name of the ticket. Something like that. It's a fifty dollars scratch off, and the player won a million dollars and claimed it up near Dallas. Something like that. And then I looked at another article that was like, these are the best tickets to play in. The Texas Lottery, and it was just a garbage article that basically just uh, showed all of the available winning tickets for each scratch-off game that is available. But it made it seem like they were going to give you some sort of, like, analysis of, you know... The number of winners versus the number of available tickets or something like that like they were going to give you like an inside edge or something like on what game to play and or that's what i was expecting so when i read the article super disappointed so if you see it you can find the same information on the texas lottery webpage you don't have to read some fake news article that was pretty much fake news all right here we go tickets 109 125 we got 17 of them we are looking for pop prints and multipliers plus we always want to know is it the dogs that are cooler or the cats who will win today dogs or cats i saw the lightning bolt and i was like oh there's a winner but no i'm looking for a paw print Lightning bolts are on those 10x powers. I like that game. Are that power 10x? I said it backwards. That's because I'm dyslexic. All right. No paw print, no multiplier. That one is a losing dog. He's not as not so cool in my book. All right, kitty cat. Bring me a prop, a paw print or a multiplier. And you and I can be friends. Kitty cat down. Back on the dog's side of the court. Paw print. We got a winner. The doggies are winning. He brought me two dollars. Break even. You're going to have to do better than that, puppy dog. Those kitty cats will sneak up on you. But not this cat. Nothing there. No multiplayer, no paw print. All right, dogs, time to step it up. You need to show me more paw prints or a multiplier. No. All right. Kitty cat's chance to break even or steal the lead, that is. Nothing there.
kitty cat. Although I have a feeling this is a winning puppy dog. And if it's not, then the kitty cats are definitely going to steal. No paw print. Here we go, kitty cat. It's your time to shine. No. Back on the puppy dogs. There's a paw print. Just one. What'd you bring me, puppy dog? Another two dollars. One twenty. We got six tickets to go. All right, kitty cat. Back to back winners. No, not so much. Starting to feel like the puppy dogs are just going to run away with it today. New. No one in there. All right, we got two left, 24 and 25. No big winner so far. I always feel like end of the book and the beginning of the book have big winners. We didn't see any of that evidence today. And we're behind the odds because we need this puppy dog to be a winner. This is not going to happen. There's no multiplayer and no paw print. And the multiplayer is a, oh, it's a, a dollar bill symbol. You know what? The whole time I've been thinking there was a different symbol. Let me go back and double check for dollar bills. That's a gold bar. That's a gold bar. No dollar bill. No dollar bill. No dollar bill. No dollar bill. Nope, no dollar bill. No dollar bill. I probably would have snapped to you and realized that it was a dollar bill if I'd have seen that, but I don't think I saw one. No dollar bill. Double checking my results. No dollar bill. No dollar bill. Lots of lightning bolts. But no dollar bill. No paw print. No dollar bill. <coughs> Excuse me. And the last one. No, definitely no paw print at all. Man, we came out on the short end of the stick with that. I totally picked the wrong tickets today. We got two $2 winners out of 17 tickets that I bought. So, yeah, I didn't even get three winners. I should have got three. Yeah, oh well, you know, like I said, scratch tickets. You know what you're getting into when you buy them. It's a long shot. Kind of like getting struck by lightning, but it could happen. Thank you so much if you've been watching the video for this long. I hope you were entertained. I appreciate you watching. Remember, you can't win if you don't play. And good luck picking your own scratch-off tickets. Peace out, everybody.